Welcome to Quick Tips on Finding an Internship, presented by the UC Berkeley Career Center. Through this workshop, we'll talk about different ways that you can use to find internships. First thing that you want to do is identify your strengths. Know what you can bring to employers that can help their work. Here are top strengths that employers seek. Try to think of examples of when you demonstrated these strengths, and this can be very helpful when crafting a resume, cover letter, or preparing for interviews. We're going to go into these different internship search methods, including meeting with employers, online search sites, creating your own internship, and networking and connecting. Each of these methods has its own benefit, so you want to mix it up and use multiple methods for the best results. Meeting with employers. The Career Center works hard to create opportunities for students and employers to connect, both in person and virtually. These events are on Handshake, and they can be a great way for you to explore internship opportunities and career fields. When meeting with employers, remember to introduce yourself, including your name, major, career interests, and skills. Be sure to contact the employers, get their contact information, or connect on LinkedIn so that you can continue the conversation. This shows that you're interested and it helps them remember who you are. Online search. There are a lot of online sites that can help you with your internship search. These sites include Indeed, LocalWise, and FlexJobs if you're looking for remote work. On the Career Center site, you can find additional links for internship sites that are organized by career fields like business, communications, and social impact. If there are no open opportunities that are available, consider creating your own internship. Do your research and see if there are any gaps that you can fill. Create a proposal for the work that you would like to do as an intern and reach out to employers with your proposal. Describe clearly and concisely what you're offering to do for the company and why you think they would benefit from it. Networking and connecting. The National Association of Colleges and Employers surveyed employers asking how they recruit for their internship and co-op programs. In 2019, 93% of employers recruited by asking current or former interns and 80% of employers used alumni referrals. That means it is a lot about who you know, and this can be very useful in your internship search. So where do you get started? You can use the Berkeley Career Network. It's an online platform that allows students and alumni to create a community of professional connections. You can reach out to alumni who are willing to help, whether it's reading a resume, or providing a job shadowing opportunity. You can also find alumni on LinkedIn. If you go to the UC Berkeley page on LinkedIn, you can click on the alumni tab. And that's where you can find alumni by location, where they work, what they're doing, and their major. You can also find professionals by looking for groups on LinkedIn as well. Now, some of you may be asking, how can I connect if I don't know these professionals? A great way to do this is informational interviewing. It's an informal conversation where you can get to know someone working in your area and you can get information about fields, industries, positions, find out about career paths, get tips on insider knowledge and expand your network of contacts. Here's an example of how you can reach out. You can keep it simple. You don't have to keep it long. Just ask for 15 to 20 minutes and that you're looking for advice or information. The key thing is once you connect, you wanna make sure that you stay in touch so you're cultivating the relationship. Now that you've heard of different ways that you can look for internships, here's a checklist of things that you can do to make sure that you are ready for the internship search. Polish your resume and cover letter, create and update your LinkedIn profile, practice your interviewing skills, 
identify and connect with references and perform informational interviews to explore opportunities. You can go to the Career Center website by going to career.berkeley.edu where you can access go-to resources, which are awesome tips, videos, samples that can help you with some of those checklist items. You can meet with a career counselor. You can set up an appointment for 30 minutes on Handshake, where you can talk to a counselor for resume and cover letter advice, interview prep help, tips on how to do an informational interview and more. And video and phone appointments are available. Subscribe to Career Mail on Handshake. This is a way for you to get up-to-date news on new jobs, internships, and events in different career fields. And lastly, connect with us. Follow us on these different social media platforms to learn about new opportunities that you can check out. And of course, we'd love to see you at the Career Center. So we look forward to seeing you soon.